Good morning. Morning. Let's go. Peace out, boys. Peace. I think the camera I'm using on the back has nothing. Has actually nothing. Yeah, at so all. we're not really going to get anything until sunrise. <laughs> Good morning ladies and gentlemen, I hope that you're all good and we are on the road to Snowdon for the second time but this time round we are hiking up the Watkins Path which is the second hardest path I believe and uh, we are well we're about half an hour from the service stop we've been on the road since 4am I was up at 3 I decided not to film and do some cinematic intro instead so uh, today's been a good day little adventure for the end of August and I'm not tired yet, but I do need coffee. Did you get ahead of us? Because bike was in failure. <laughs> Coffee, breakfast, sorted. And in the sake of exploration, last time we were here, I just spun the stop and didn't visit it. But I'm actually going to make the effort, Niantic, because you've done the smart thing. I'm going to explore what what on earth this this like steam engine thing is that's this up ahead here. It's a beautiful clear day. It's supposed to be like this at the top of Snowden as well. No cloud or anything, which is going to be amazing. This is the steam hammer. This is gargantuan. Look, Jesus. I'll give you some facts for the day. This contraption here weighs 28 tons. It's four and a half meters tall. Let's go back to the car, have the remainder of my breakfast. I need to eat. Damn sure. I'm excited for today. Come on, it's a hike. It's an adventure. It's good to get out of the city, you know. I'm changing the camera angle. I'm, uh, uh, the new mount, I rate the new mount. I might have slagged off the artwork of it beforehand in a previous video, but this has actually done its business really, really nicely for the back view. Not so sure about the actual quality of the image, considering I, I checked it out on the monitor and it was just completely dark. <laughs> Let's get back on the road. Two hours, seven minutes to get to Snowden. Hopefully we're gonna have some beautiful, beautiful cinematics for the drive there. Ladies and gentlemen, the boys and I are on our way for the second hike to Snowden this year, and it's 7:30 in the morning, and we're having a great time. Now, with me is our man, the demon in human flesh, the maniac behind the wheel, Mikey. So, on the back you can see the monster, the chisel beast, <laughs> and in front of us, 
uh, two guys you don't really care about. <laughs> we will come back with more information later when we get to the hike. situation is bleak, it's desperate, we're stuck behind some tortoise, I don't know, it's a 60 mile an hour road we're doing 35 and we've still got an hour and 20 minutes to go. What's worrying is if everyone here is heading snow, that's the big thing. <laughs> Why has it done that? Take two without the camera. The camera was about to undo itself. <laughs> Trance remix. Very interesting. <laughs> Got here. Also, focus is broken. We've arrived. Got the correct parking. We've parked literally 100 feet from the start of the Watkins Path, the south face. So this should be a little bit more unique, guys. The bus. Nice. Yeah, I know, I know. Shall I get the fall over done now? <laughs> My legs are very slightly broken. We're actually close, a lot closer okay, to sea level. The car, go back. <laughs> this path starts closer to sea level than the one we did before. And this is actually beautiful. Zero phone signal here because we're obviously so low down. But I think obviously we know higher up the mountain, there's gonna be phone signal. Is there gonna be an old 
cheeky, shiny Galarian Stunfist raid potential. Let's have a look, shall we? Because last time we hiked, there were no raids at all. I've got a gold gym on the PYG path. Can I get a gold gym on the Watkins path? That would be dope. <laughs> Took a small shortcut, which was very, very steep. S sweating quite badly, it's just so hot. It's actually baking sun. So if I look very unappealing on camera, I can only apologize. Maybe downgrade it to 144p, and you won't notice it on YouTube. It's all going on the OnlyFans. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> extra, extra on the OnlyFans. You take the one that keeps straight, not the one that goes left. Over. Is that straight? I have no idea. Does that count as straight? We can't tell if it's straight, they both kind of go left, but one curves round all the way to the left and one kind of keeps on path. Okay, um, I guess we'll have a look. Over. Where are we looking? Direction troubles. <laughs> this stone is of great significance but there's no phone signal, so I can't look it up on Pokemon Go. <laughs> so, um, no facts. <laughs> trying to do cinematic shots while moving and I just <laughs> fall over. <laughs> That's next. <laughs> I'm only keeping hydrated, and all that seems to happen is I just sweat more. That's why I'm keeping hydrated so I can sweat. I'm gonna say, anybody UK based or anybody when world traveling is okay and able to be done, you've got to come to Snowden and do a hike. Don't do it in a day like we're doing because we're mental. But a weekend hike is Snowden. It's a must do. And still phone, no phone signal. I must have had phone signal very, very briefly at one point because Twitch alerted me to somebody going live. But I think that was like five seconds. <laughs> oh, I think that was the path. Yeah. I think we keep going up to the left. That's the right, sorry. I have phone signal. Let's hatch our first egg. But this time a Snowden. Oh, it's a magic up that's not shiny and it's terrible. Goodbye. Basically, no, nothing here. Oh, there's literally no stops at all on this side. Although, that's the way we look. The path actually goes that way, all the way around there. It goes up, up and to the right. Oh my god. I'm going to catch a Wooloo here because Wooloo, there are many sheep here. It's a, it's a uh, farming area of Snowden. So, we'll Perfect. catch a Wooloo. Why not? Might get a little AR shot of a Wooloo here. I think. There you go, there's a wild Wooloo. Wooloo caught somewhere it doesn't recognize the GPS, but that's perfect. I don't know how high we are up here at the mountain, but phone signal's been hit. <laughs> oh, we have to get on top of the ridge, dude. Oh, Lord. <laughs> Let me know in the comments what you think of these call signs. So we're going with Maverick and Iceman, because we're the lead pack, Top Gun. And uh, at the bottom, it's Colonel, Captain, and Corporal Slow. <laughs> Are you Maverick or Iceman? Uh, I'll go Maverick because I'm driving. So I'm okay with that. Is Iceman the one who dies in the film? I can't remember. Oh, or is that Goose? Sure, I think it's Goose then. who dies. <laughs> no, Tom Cruise survives. It's a sequel, man. <laughs> We've just done a bit off piece and done a sort of light sprint up here. Yeah. And then you look up that way. Ridge up there. And along down there and up there. <laughs> you can see 
the PYG route that we did before, all the way up there, all along there, and then back down the miners track, the miners path, all the way around the lakes and all the way over there. You can literally see our entire June hike from up here, yeah. everything, even the car park right at the bottom I think. Yeah you can, that's the car park right at the bottom there, with the hostel and everything, that's astonishing. But now, we're going up there, halfway maybe. Mad. We've stopped at the top before the really difficult ascent and there was a Snorlax raid at the Summit Gym. I've just sent a bunch of invites. So Alison Becker, Ian Warfall, jumps in Geo Germs, two of the Patreon squad, and Ian, of course, from the Incense Podcast. By the time you watch this video, episode 29 of Incense the Pokemon Go Podcast will be available to listen to. But let's do a Snorlax raid at the top of Snowden. We're not at the top, we're remoting in because honestly it had four minutes left on the raid. We are, we are not doing that scramble in four minutes. <laughs> Can we please get a shiny Snorlax at the top of the gym? At the top of a mountain, that ends it. Come on. That would be the dopest thing. Honestly, we had shiny Lotad the last time. We were way down on the uh, the PYG path. Nothing so far on the Watkins path. I have been gottering and checking and stuff. Down goes the Snorlax. I don't care about Hundo, don't care about anything. I just want to see the sparkles. I want to see some sparkles. Squatting, and this is a bad idea. I didn't get on the board, but congrats to Alistair Becker for the style and Geogerms for the Traveller badge. Will it be bright blue? No. Oh, no shiny. 1817, I'm pretty sure that's dreadful. Snorlax Court. No XL for it, but that's fine. It is dev dreadful IVs, but the Welsh tag on there. Beautiful. Can we reach the Watkins? No, we're, we're slightly too far away from the, the marker, which is quite annoying, but there are no more raids. Look. You see the last time the gyms and stuff are there. All right, we're having lunch. We are indeed. Lunch and hydration are really needed. What a view. What a damn view. Uh -huh. Yes. That. That's the path we've done. Oh God. This is more realistic of an actual hike because we've gone from more sea level up to the summer. So this is a nearly 1100 meter ascent. It's going to get worse. <laughs> Let's do it. <laughs> so I mean, a loose surface. Okay. Time out. Huh. <laughs> Let's do tag team. Milo versus Wild. <laughs> Man, that was proper. You got it. You got it, bro. Time out. <laughs> I'm doing this one-handed. I'm an idiot. Kareem is in his element. I would be in my element if I wasn't vlogging the bloody thing. Oh my god. What? Oh my god. Oh. Look at this. The rest of this is a little bit easier because we've got stairs, steps up, but that. It looks vertical, it's mad mad path. I am dead. Literally, if I stop every five seconds, I've just got a stitch. I haven't had a stitch for years. But, markers. Markers. There we go. There we freaking go. Summit's that way. Give it a minute. I'm also dangerously low on camera memory space, so the height down might be very short. <laughs> how, how sick is that? How sick is that? Also, I only have six minutes left on the SD card, so uh, no more B-roll. The summit will not be being visited this time because of a 40 minute queue. Had a little lunch stop, and now we're gonna have a little descent down the South Ridge, which is that one. And I have 
five minutes of SD card space left, so um, basically no footage now <laughs> until we get to the bottom. <laughs> video clip quickly on the phone because this camera is now running out of memory card space. This reminds me of like, I don't know, a video game or something. I don't, I don't remember what video game, I've seen like, you know, jagged rocks and stuff like this, but we're beginning the descent. Don't know quite how long the descent's gonna take, to be honest, but that means we can get a longer swim in. We are gonna go at the bottom of uh, the entire walk, there were a couple of waterfalls and, and pools. I'm gonna go and earn a well deserved cool off. South Ridge, South Ridge Path, it's earned its name. <laughs> Quite rightfully so. Jesus. And the, the other drop on the other side is just as mental. Staggering view, but if, like me, Foss, you suffer from the vertigo or aquaphobia, the fear of heights or balance problems, if you suffer from fear of heights, don't do the South Ridge. <laughs> Still by a way, I was going. Yes. We're done. It's now grass. Goodbye rocks, goodbye scree, goodbye polished bloody ridges and stuff that fall off. <sighs> Probably about another 25, 30 minutes to get down to, well we are gonna have a dip in the lake because honestly, I'd love to just cool off. Man. <laughs> that left turn. Down, down there. And then to the lakes, well, ponds, pools, whatever the bloody hell they are. We're nearly done. It is quarter to five. We are back, well, almost where we started. I am so tired, my neck, my neck is killing me. I've been craning down having to look where I'm walking all day. Jeez. Out the car now. All good, changing some fresh gear. Looking a bit crazy because of the hat hair. My Bulbasaur t-shirt was disintegrating because of my sweat next to my backpack. Just need to sort a few things out and then change the memory card on this. Currently, it's 20 to seven. Is it? It's 20 to seven in the evening, man. So we're gonna get back to London probably about half 11, possibly midnight or so, depending on how fast we drive. I need water desperately. I haven't had a drink since the summit of Snowden. <laughs> the relief that this place is still open. Yes. Yes. Oh, without quality focus. <laughs> Time to hit the road for the final wave. 
on away. The I hope squad, we crash and die. Of the squad. Wow. Back to London. Back to London. Safely. 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 Safety first. Maybe. Mm. Maybe. No, definitely. <laughs> Bloopers. bloopers. I don't know how I'm going to get in. I'm not going to lie. It, it's like, your car's quite like the gap isn't massive. No, it to, really to jump. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Made it back home. It's about midnight. Uh, taking Kareem home. Now just to unload the car and call it a night. And he's copied all the footage from all of the desks of the SD cards from today. Quite a nice, quiet drive home. So uh, should we pop into the house and round things up there? I think that's probably a better idea. My Apple Watch has actually died. <laughs> Again, we've been on the road for about 21 hours. 21 hour day. Big thank you to Kareem and Mythos. And if there's any extra B-roll, thank you to Mike and Karim for helping out. Honestly, helping out with a little bit of the B-roll. Let me know what you think of the new camera angles. I tested out the new mount. Almost went a bit wrong. We almost lost one camera. This video might go up many days later because I think I've got over a hundred gig plus of footage to go through which is kind of nuts. I hope you enjoyed, hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know in the comments of course if you did. With that I'm going to say thank you very much for watching everybody. Please make sure to subscribe if you are new with the notifications on so you don't miss any uploads or live streams and of course smash the like button if you enjoyed the video of course. No shiny on this adventure unfortunately but we did hit a Snorlax ray which brought that summit gym into bronze which i guess i'm quite happy about and i got some distance trade mons out of it which is cool we've been very lucky with all three of the adventures we've had very good weather and today was just perfect it was just a brilliant day sunshine glorious glorious weather so i'm really really thankful for that with that i will be seeing you in the next video ladies and gentlemen do take care <laughs>